I'm Jennifer Angel. These are your stars for August Aries. Now this is a good month for you to get organized. You really need to get yourself, you know, as organized as you can so you can stay productive with the Mars energy still there in your opposite sign, all to do with relationships um, and partnerships. You want to be able to be stay the leader uh, because you're very much a leader. So you want to be able to use that energy in a most productive way as you can. And what happens with the Mars energy is that if you don't use it productively, it can really just send you running around in circles. So, you know, you're busy, but you're not achieving anything, okay? Um, and so for you, Aries, because you like to, you know, you like the excitement of starting something new, it's really important that you use the Mars energy, which is your ruling planet, to the greatest advantage. Now, for a career, for career and money, if we have a look specifically at this, there's a whole social vibe happening around your business this month. And the people that you meet, it's like you can meet people that are going to be influential to you on some level. Um, so, you know, watch those chance meetings. But really, is there, is there really anything, you know, is there really such a thing as a chance meeting or is it destined? So, um, you know, I really think it's probably a little bit of both. So when you watch the signposts and you, you, things start to fall into place, that's an indication to me that you're on the right path, okay? So keep your eye open for that. Now there could be some conflict between your home and work um, this month as well. So it's almost like you've got so much going on around your work life but there's also a lot happening on your personal life as well so you're going to have to just make sure that it's balanced and if you're busy in one area make sure that you also schedule in um, meetings or gatherings or events for the other area if it's all in the calendar then it'll get done okay now mars your ruling planet moves into the solar eighth house on the 23rd so over this period and it's there right through for a six week period so over that time is a time when you can bring a closure to um, official matters or anything that's been dragging on now it can get a boost of energy and come to a, a close okay so be patient there if things don't seem to be moving forward at the rate right now that you would like them to now love and romance so Mars and Saturn both in your solar seventh house right and up until the 23rd when Mars moves into your eighth house um, a conjunct on the 15th. So this is like a real burst of energy. Now, of course, Mars and Saturn are like opposite energies. Mars is like go-getter and rash and let's get things done with Saturn likes to go steady, day by day, methodical, make sure it's all, uh, you know, to together and the foundations are set. So when they come together, personally, I think it works you know beautifully because certainly in the area for you in your seventh house for you Aries it allows you to move fast which you like to do think act and get things done but it also allows you to make the decisions and the actions that are going to set the solid foundations for you to move forward with for the future so over this period of time some of you I'm sure will be popping the question or just making love um, more permanent, the big C, the big co big commitment in some way in your life. Okay, it's also a good time where you can meet someone new for those who are single. So watch out for that. And the, uh, there's a new moon on the 17th, and this also helps singles to meet someone and to start new, or for people that are in a relationship, just to get a boost of energy to start afresh. But you need to be proactive about it. Okay. So, um, you know, don't, don't expect someone else to do all the work. Not that you would, Aries, all right? Now, your lucky numbers are 15, 16, 17, and 30. And I've listed your most dynamic day as the 15th when Saturn and Mars come together and really just give you that absolutely dynamic connection on a personal level. Have a great month, Aries. Love and luck to you. I'm Jennifer Angel. Thanks for watching.